everybody. Come on in. Happy Thursday. It's almost Friday. Woo. All right. Awesome. Hi, everybody. Come on in. Four o'clock on the dot. I have a really neat workout for everybody today. We are going to be doing a dancer bod workout. So I created this one because I was, a, I'm a former dancer. I still dance recreationally, but I just think that dancing is the best exercise and it's super fun. I realized after I named it dancer bod that everybody probably thought we were dancing today. And unfortunately we're not dancing today, but that being said, I will do, I can always do another workout and choreograph some dance moves for everybody. I'm happy to do that. So if that's something you're interested in, definitely let me know. So with that said, the goal of today is to really focus on form, movement, balance, little bit of flexibility, and all in all, ultimately, I want you to remember dancers are graceful. It's all about making the movements look easy, even though they're really hard. So I want you to kind of keep that in mind throughout this exercise today and try to, you know, stay light, stay airy. You know, I don't want to see it in these moves. I don't want to see people like, oh, Ooh, like I want to see you up and up so lay on the feet we're gonna start off with some squats so turn the feet out my usual turned out squats okay but these squats today I want these to be nice and light so these are nice and light squats I don't want these full down to the ground I just want these nice and light I want you to focus a lot today on opening your your knees all the way out I want you to focus on keeping your body up so we did a lot of legs yesterday, so you should be feeling this like now. I feel it already. So this is just gonna kind of seal the deal. Okay, so we're gonna, if you watch me, we're gonna take it up. So we're gonna go tap to the front, tap to the side. So weight is center, weight is on the left foot. Weight is center, weight is on the left foot. So when you do this, I want, the leg turned out the entire time, so turn out the leg, right? I don't want it turned in, I want it turned out the entire time. So leg is turned out and down. So we're doing like a combined tondu and a squat here. So front and side and front and side. Press off both feet. Okay, I want those knees nice and straight. So those, boom, the knees are nice and straight at the top. And straight. Now, body stays center. I don't want to see you going here and here. I want this straight forward. Okay, so you're going to notice what's happening. Your booty is getting engaged, right? Those inner thighs are pulling to the center. So inner thighs here and inner thighs open, okay? So this is, dancing is all about turnout. Well, ballet is anyway. So watch what we're going to do. Lift the leg front and side, front and side. Now up and side. So we're gonna get it, we're gonna do front and side, side and down. So it's front and side, side and down. Okay, front. Same thing as before. Breathing front and side, side and down. Remember, keeping it light. Chest is proud. Up and down. Up. And down, okay, last one, last two, up and down, last two. Now watch what we do. We take it back, side, and up. So plie to the back, plie to the side. Plie, take it to the back. That's the right leg going back, to the back, to the side. Now, when you go back, I want the body square forward. Okay, so I want the hips forward. I also don't want to see any leaning here. I want this hips nice and square. You're going to have to 
Feel that opposition from the left side pulling and your butt is gonna go nice and tight. Okay, inner thighs. Last one. Now we lift it back and side, up and side. So we're just doing the same exact movement, just bring the leg to the back this time. Up and side. We're working on that balance. Up and down. Okay, up. This is really, really good for our core as well and our posture muscles. And two, up, last one. Back and two. Bring it back to those nice and light squats. That right leg is pretty tired. We're gonna do it on the left leg. So we do, we take it front and side, up and down. We take it front and side. So same thing here. Point the toes and down. Point and down. Push off and down. Up and down. Push off. Up and down. Up. Beautiful. Keep breathing. And we're up and we're down. Just warming up the body. Last one. Now we push off. Woo! And down. Up and down. We take it up and down. So try not to go like this with the hip. I want the hip and the legs to stay whoop. Like your, your leg is like a little pendulum. So it just goes whoa and over, up. <laughs> you like my sound effects? Up and down. Last two, come on. Up, down. So the challenge is, is keeping your form. Up to the back we go. Back, side, we're just, we're just tapping it for now. Back and side, up and down. Take it back, side, squeezing the butt right here and here. So here we squeeze and here we squeeze. Back and side, last two, come on, one woo, and two. And now we're gonna take it up. Kick it up a notch, here we go. We take it back, plie, push off. We take it back. Plie, push off. So you want to feel the transfer of the weight. So I'll say it. It's right leg, center, right leg, center. Whew. Right? So we push off. One leg to two legs. Really great for the balance and for the core. Let's do one more. Last and one. Gorgeous. Beautiful. Okay, come down on hands and knees. First, I had a rookie. Rookie, your fans are right there, your adoring fans. <laughs> He's come a long way, hasn't he? <laughs> He's uh, come into my shots and really disrupt things. Okay. So, I want you in a tabletop, okay? Knees are hip width apart. Tuck the toes under, and then lift the knees up off the ground. So, if this is going to be too hard for you, um, you can do clamshells with your legs. But I'd really like you to try this if, if you can. So, hands are into, pressing into the ground, knees come off the ground, we stay here. We just open the legs and close the legs. So, right leg is right, left leg is left like those clamshells. Feel like you have a resistance band around your knees. So those knees don't come all the way in, they just come right back to center. Pick up the pace. We're breathing. Abs are in. Beautiful, let's go. Four, three, two, now hold it here. Both knees to the right, to the center to the left, to the center. Right and center, left, pick up the pace. We go right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Let's four and three, two, last one, lower it down, relax. Okay, now coming to lay down on the floor, right foot comes over left, so we're gonna work on those inner thighs. So 
So left leg is long and out and the, and the foot is flexed. Here we go, just up and down, up and down, up and down. Now form is very important here. I want the head and the foot in one straight line. If you're doing it right, you should be feeling it already. Okay, so up and down. I love leg lifts so much. They're so great and they just, I feel them so much. Pulse it up, pulse it up. So hold it up and pulse it. Foot is flexed. Let's go. Two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. Lower that leg. Okay, legs are together. Now you're gonna take your top leg and kick it up and down. Now I don't want it all the way down, so I don't want it to touch your foot. I want you to hold it up a bit. So body is straight here, nothing's moving except the leg. You have a tendency to want to like fall back like this, but just keep the leg up. Squeezing the butt now. Squeeze and squeeze, squeeze. So you're squeezing like you have that resistance band on. Long and lean, everyone. Long and lean. And you guess it. Pick it up and pulse it. Pulse it. I want you to, when you pulse it, to feel like you're pulsing up, not down. I want you to pulse up, 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 up. Okay, you're feeling that in the backs of your legs and your butt. But still remember about those inner thighs. Let's do another count of eight here. Let's go eight. Five, four, and three, and two, and one. Woo! Let it relax. Okay, flip over onto your back. I'm actually going to face this way. So you can see me a little bit better, hopefully. Maybe not, I don't know. Looks like I'm in the comments. All right, so the right leg is gonna come up into what's called an attitude. It's a ballet move, it's called an attitude. So it's like this. So knee, right knee is turned out, left long, leg is long and straight, and that's it. So we come down. Now, I want it up and down. I don't want the foot to hit the floor. So it's up coupe. Coupe is just when you Tap the ankle bone of the other foot with your heel. Boop. Up and down. Now, what is your stomach doing? I want it in. I want it pushing into the ground. Is your left leg long and lean? I want it to be. Okay? If you want to think of this as a crunch, that's fine, but I want your head to stay on the ground. Okay, you're really working those inner thighs. So your left leg should be turned out in opposition to your right leg. Now, pulse it, pulse it. Again, I want you to feel like you're pulsing it up. Drop your leg to that position where it's hard. So if you're here and you're like, this is easy, then drop it a little bit. Wherever you feel the most resistance is where I want you to, to stay with this, okay? Let's go, eight, seven, six, and five, four, three, two, and one. Now watch, we take the leg down, and then we take it out to the side, out to the side. So, take it out as far as you can without sacrificing form, okay? So I want that foot to be a little bit in front of you like a diagonal, not flat out to the side because your hip will just splay open and you'll never be able to maintain that position. Stomach is really important here. Okay, if you need to put your hands pushing into the mat, that's fine. Squeezing those inner thighs together. Now we pulse it out, pulse it out. If this hurts your right here too much, your hip flexor, just lower the leg. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, and five, four, three, two, and one. Hold it, relax. Okay, we're going to get into our ab series here. 
So I want you to just watch me and follow along. All right, so elbows behind the head. Knees are hugging in and we're going in and out. In and out. Now I want your elbows to come in today when you squeeze the knees in. So I want in with the elbows. Squeeze it. You can lift your butt up a little bit off the floor when you bring them in. Okay, two more. And then we lower the head, so lower the head, and I want leg lifts. Okay, now remember, small range of motion. I don't want this all the way up here and all the way down here, okay? The legs never touch the floor. Abs are nice and tight. Now, watch, we beat the legs. Beat, 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 beat. Let's go, come on. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring the knees back in. We're up. Actually, no, stay down, sorry. Bring those knees to tabletop. Flex the feet. Head is gonna come up. And we're just gonna pump those arms. Let's go. Look at your belly button. Squeeze up higher, higher. Last count of eight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Let it relax. Rookie's sleeping. Amazing. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, that is my dancer's workout. We're going to do the whole thing again now. So, get ready. I have a feeling everyone really likes this workout. I don't know why, but I have a feeling I'm going to get a lot of messages after this. People like, I love that one. Can we do more? Sure. Whatever you want. Meet me in my squat. Always considering the inner thighs. Now remember what I said in the beginning, which was, what did I say? Pop quiz. What did I say I wanted everyone to focus on? That's similar to a dancer or a ballerina that they do when they're doing workouts. <sighs> do, do, do. Okay, what I said was, I want you to remember to be graceful. So let's remember that this time through. Okay, so plie and up, plie and up, plie and up, plie and up. Beautiful. We're just working on those muscles, long and lean. Let's go. Remember, chest is proud. So you are learning lots of ballet moves. Plie, tendu, coupe, attitude. So plie, now we lift, up, little lift. Try not to sink in the hips when you do this. I want feeling up on that supporting leg. So that supporting leg has to be really strong. Support your body with that leg. It's all in that leg. Up and two. Three and four, last two, up, last one. Now you know what we do, we take it back. And tendu. Back, side, tendu, and side. Take it back, and side, tendu, and side, back. This is a great one to do. If you just really want to crush those inner thighs, seven now, pick up the legs. So up and down, up and down. Also an amazing butt workout. I'll never forget when I was a ballerina, 
I had a teacher once named Miss Gershaw, and she said to the whole entire class, everybody, look at Emma's butt. She said, if you're working properly, your butt muscle should show. She said, so Emma, good job. <laughs> I was like, oh, who knew ballerinas were actually supposed to have butts? Okay. Five, six. Other side, we take it back to the front, back to the side. Back to the side, back to the front. Okay. Beautiful, we're working. I like how the squat is not like super like low like that. I like how it's just nice and light. I've been trying to really do that in my workouts lately myself, of just trying to like not sink into the workout and try to really stay light on those muscles. Okay, let's do it, let's do it. And up, back to the side, take it down and up down to the side, down, up, down to the side. Now a lot of these combinations, I, I obviously made all of them up. I make up all this stuff, but I think about them very carefully to what I think will be the most effective in a short amount of time. So that's what we're doing here, to the back now, to the side to the back, to the side. We're just sculpting the body, the whole entire body, in like 30 minutes. I'm already sweating. <laughs> One and two, now we lift the leg. To the back, to the side. So remember what I said about that supporting leg? Pulling up. So here we go, pull up and up. Squeeze the butt. Yep, this opposition is all inner thighs. Try to keep both inner thighs turned out. Last two. And one, and back. Down and up. Beautiful, down to the floor. Oops. To that tabletop position. I'm tripping all over the place. Okay, so. Tabletop, toes tucked under. The legs go out and in, out and in. Pick up the pace, we go out, in, out, in. And five, six, seven, eight. Knees go right, center, left, center, right, center, left and center. Pick it up, right, left, right, left, Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Whew. Okay, we're coming down to the other side now with those inner thigh lifts. So I want the left leg cross over the right. You can lay down, get comfortable, flex the foot, and we go up, down, down, up, down. I think Rookie's tired just from watching my workout. <laughs> There's no other explanation because this dog has so much freaking energy. Okay, so inner thighs. I should have called this the inner thigh workout. But it's not, because we're truthfully working so many different areas of the body. Here we go. Pulse it up, up. Pulsing it up to the sky. Foot is flexed. Toes are pointed. Toes are pointed forward. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, three, two, one. Stack the legs. Left leg goes up and down, up and down. Remember, we're not touching the floor. Okay, stomach is in tight, butt is under. Take it up, down, up, up and down. Squeezing the butt, and three, Last two, then we're gonna hold it. We're gonna pulse it up, 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 up. Legs are long, long, long. Can you take the leg higher? Two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, another count of eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let it relax. Okay, I'm gonna flip around on your backs. We're gonna go into that attitude. So with the left leg, so it's up and it's coupe. Remember, we're not touching the floor. Up and down. Right leg is long. Now try to keep those hips. I don't want one hip higher than the other. I want both hips square and in the same line. So literally the only thing moving is that left leg. Okay. Perfect. Right leg is long. Keep that hip in its socket. If you need to put your leg a little lower, like here, that's fine. Now can we pulse it? Pulse it up, up. So when you pulse it up, I want you to think of pulling your heel towards your face. Your heel towards your face. That is going to engage those inner sides. I'm shaking. Eight, seven, six, and five, four, three, two, and one. Feet are down, we take the left leg out and in, out and in, out and in, out and in. Squeezing the butt the whole time. Now we hold it and we pulse it, pulse it up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, pulse it up, let's go. Eight, seven, six, and five, four, three, two, and one, let it relax. Last section, those lovely, lovely abs. Okay, I want the hands behind the head. Let's flow, we take it in and out, in, out, and out. Take the butt off the floor, up, and out. So it's up with the butt and out. Up and out. Can we do four more? Four and three. Yes, we can. Two. Last one. Lower down. Take the legs up and down. Take it up and down. Push through. Squeeze the abs. Squeeze them. This is the moment. Now we're gonna beat the feet together. Let's go. Legs are long, feet are pointed. You're a ballerina right now. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Feet come together. Head peels up. Let's go. I want breathing. Mimic my breathing. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Let's do it again. Two more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Oh my goodness. Amazing. That was a really, really great, excellent workout. 28 minutes. 28 minutes, and I'm sweating and I feel so much more toned already. Everybody, thank you so much for joining me. I will not be back until Monday because as you know, I do this from Monday through Thursdays now. I will see you on Monday at 4 p.m. Eastern time. Remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's at the link in my bio on my Instagram page. And shoot me a message. Let me know what's going on. Let me know what you think of the workouts, if there's something you'd like me to do. Whatever it may be, I hope you have a beautiful weekend. I hope it's sunny out for once. And thank you so much for joining. Have a great rest of your day. Take care, bye.